Good afternoon, I'm Hasiel Cordoba. This is the 69 News Netcast. If you weren't watching 69 News at noon, here's a bit of what you missed. Day three of the trial for a man accused of helping to kill three young men in Bucks County is underway today. Yesterday, jurors heard more gruesome details in the murder trial of Sean Kratz. He's accused of helping his cousin Cosmo DiNardo kill Dean Finocaro, Thomas Mayo, and Mark Sturgis in 2017. Police arrived to a crazy scene, a house fire in Northampton County where they say they found a naked man covered in blood. Police were called a little after nine last night to Quince Road in Lehigh Township. They say they found 24-year-old Zachary Pammer nearby sitting inside a car covered in blood. Police say the female driver of the car saw the fire and stopped to help, and that's when Pammer allegedly forced his way in the car and assaulted her. She was able to get away and call 911. Police believe drugs may have been involved. Four people were taken to the hospital after a head-on crash in Monroe County. Two pickup trucks collided in front of the Polk Township Fire Company around 7 last night. Crews had to free several people trapped inside the trucks. And in weather, it's cold and windy today with highs in the 40s, with temperatures dropping later tonight. Here is your seven-day forecast. For more local news, watch 69 News or get updates at WFMZ.com. With the 69 News Netcast, I'm Haseo Cordoba.